paddle tab. Now, you'll notice it doesn't come with any bolts. The bolts are, in this case, I've got two and a half inch bolts because I'm gonna simply attach to a joist, go through those holes and hold this on, this one joist onto the paddle tab. Sometimes we'll have a four by something or other and we'll put a cut in and then just have this paddle tab, you know, you'll need a longer bolt for a four by. So for that reason, we don't include bolts in the paddle tab package. Okay, so at this time, I wanna locate where on tree number four the paddle tab should go. It's nice if it goes in level, but it's not critical. Maybe the center or maybe the lower half of a joist. So if this joist was up, as it will be in the long run, I'm suggesting that a paddle tab might be placed in the lower half of the joist itself. So when I transfer that over to the tree behind, I'm gonna just say somewhere around, it's like I have x-ray vision, right? Somewhere around that level is where my paddle tab will be. So in the long run, what you're gonna see is this tree taking up the weight of this joist with the paddle tap. I've had Charlie cut the length of joist that we need and now we're gonna slide it into place so that I can get the proper aspect of the paddle tap, you know, left to right. So here we go. Charlie's ready, bring it on in. Boom. I see my mark for the paddle tab. Yeah, are you on enough meat back there, Charlie? Okay, beautiful. So then I'm gonna use the old five inch screw method, put that in the tree at the same, does that look pretty good right down the beam there, Charlie? Maybe a little, to the left. little to the left. Pretty good? Okay, so I'm gonna use that screw and uh, monitor how my drill goes in. So here you go, back Charlie to you. Okay, so I'm lined up with my screw, I'm on my mark, and now I wanna go up and down, see if I'm going in level. It's not as critical as your tab is for a paddle tab, but that's gonna be good. And here we go, I'll check one more time. Looks like we're between the lines, and I've got about three more inches to go. Lined up with the screw. One more inch, done, clearing it, great, there we go, get this started, all right, so I'm going to use the, the big pipe wrench to get this in, because we've already got it out, it's a little bit overkill, but let's go for it, nice, I like it. Oh, hey, it's so easy. Okay, Charlie, bring it in. Oh, nice, there we are. Okay, so now it's as simple as that. We've got it in place, it's nice and level, and I'm gonna go right through the paddle tab itself with the drill, half inch drill. Take my uh, torpedo level down. These bolts don't come with the paddle tab, but they're easily sized depending on how thick of member, structural member you're using. Can you send that through, Charles? Done. Beautiful. Bam, and then I'll put another hole in here. Okay, so here, we'll just tighten these up a little bit. How about that? There you are, sir. There is a paddle tab in action. Great use of a paddle tab. Extra strong, too.